Hello everyone. My name is Samriddhi Singh. I am currently pursuing MSc Food Science and Technology from Baba Sahib Bhimrao Ambedkar University. Today, I am going to talk about detailed admission procedure at the university for MSc Food Science and Technology program. Baba Sahib Bhimrao Ambedkar University is a NAAC a grade accredited university it is a central university and it was established in 1996 uh, msc food science and technology and msc food and nutrition program comes under home science department of the university the home science department of the university was established in 2007 apart from the msc programs the university also offers a PhD course in food and nutrition. There are 40 seats in food science and technology program. The candidate should have a bachelor's degree in one of the following disciples zoology, chemistry, botany, food technology, home science, microbiology and biotechnology. The duration of the course is two years. It consists of four semesters. In the first semester, we learn about the basics of food technology. In the second semester, we learn about statistical methods and techniques in food analysis. In the third semester, we learn about scientific writing. And in the fourth semester, we have our dissertation work. Apart from the course curriculum, the professors encourage all the students to publish at least two research papers in their field of interest. The fees for the first two semesters is 30,000 and for the last two semesters it's 25,000. The entrance exam is conducted every year in computer based mode. There are a total of 100 MCQs from subjects like physics, chemistry, basic microbiology, zoology, botany and EVS. There is no negative marking in the exam. One can easily prepare for the entrance examination from NCRT books of class 11th and 12th of bio, chemistry and physics. The university occupies an area of 250 acres in the city of Lucknow. It has three boys hostels and four girls hostels. The university has Gautam Buddha Central Library, which equips all the students to access research papers, journals, etc. for their dissertation work. So that's all from my side. I hope you found this video useful. All the best to all my juniors who are preparing for entrance exams. Like, share and subscribe and keep preparing with PrepFST.